Hello everybody. Um hope you had a good uh holiday. It's Christmas. Um New Year's is coming. So I hope you have a, a great New Year's Eve. Um remember to stay home and be safe. Uh sorry I haven't been updated uh here in YouTube. Um sorry if you can see the the round lens but I need my glasses so I can see um anyways um yes like I was saying sorry for my absence um I was gone for a couple weeks due to um some let's say uh it's health issues in a way um so a lot of people don't know but in the month of, of this year of january it was around the 24th i believe it was um i started to have a, a pain in like my backside uh where your, your kidneys are so I didn't think about it. I just left it as okay, maybe I hurt myself or at the time um it's before uh COVID even existed. So basically um I was just letting the pain um keep going. I wasn't taking any medication, I wasn't basically doing nothing for myself and for my uh health so um maybe i want to say two days later i had this it turned from a three to a ten at this point it was both of my sides so or your kidneys are so um let me take my glasses off because I, I feel like you guys can see sorry I don't wear makeup even though I love makeup but this is me anyways um so they had to take me to the emergency um room as soon as possible and um they found out that it was an infection uh acute meaning that it was something small um so I was in the hospital, I want to say for three, three days, and it was, I want to say, because I've never been to a hospital before, never in my life. Um, so it was an experience that every two hours, a nurse would come and see you, check on you, and all that stuff, um, basically. And it was hard because I have sleeping problems, by the way. So I wanted to sleep, but I couldn't. So what happened um, was that I had an infection on my kidneys because I don't drink water. I, um, I don't want to say I hate water. I dislike water very much but at night I noticed that I always want water like I'm always craving water um, like right here I have my uh, big gallon next to me because I uh, at night I tend to want to drink a lot of water but not in the morning so uh, I was there for three days and everything was fine and then that was my first time being in the hospital and then around when COVID started in March um, I was hospitalized again for the same reason um, it's a pain that you I don't know how to explain it. I just couldn't move. It was a pain that I was just like this, like a mummy, because I did not want to move a muscle. 
it was that painful. Um, and then around, I want to say May, again, start again, again, my kidneys. Just to make things short, um, I've been hospitalized four times in this year for my uh, kidneys. And I've been in uh, treatments, medications, um, but it's just me. How, how do you say this? Not taking care of my body and I'd be like, eh, it's going to go away. Or I don't know. I just, I didn't take care of my body. It was just whatever to me. And then slowly I saw the, um, the results, I want to say, of not taking care of my body. So... Um, my last doctor's appointment, the last, um, I guess, resolution or the last resort was dialysis. And when you go to dialysis, you're going to be in dialysis for the rest of your life. It doesn't matter if you want to take medicine instead or... Well, you're still on medicine, but it's something that you're going to do for the rest of your life because you didn't take care of your body. So right now, I do my doctor's visits. I'm not going to go much of details, but let's say I lost a lot of weight. I used to be 165. Right now, um, and then I was 140, and I'm right now I'm like 135. So I do feel skinnier. Um, I I feel pretty much the small details of my body now. Um, I wanted to let this, let you guys know the story because <sighs> this year has been, like I said, very difficult for everybody, but emotionally, physically, financially, um, it has been hard. Um, I don't tell nobody pretty much of my uh, health problems because I guess in a way I'm embarrassed because I caused I caused this, you know, to have kidney problems now. Um, so it's a big learning process. Um, so yeah, at the moment I'm taking it day by day and I hope that next year it will be better health wise for everybody I wish for everybody to be healthy and financially for me I say this because because I've been sick so much I've been struggling. (laughs) 
and people who see this and know who I am. I just want to say thank you. Sorry. Because you guys have helped me a lot. So I had to stop working. So the thing was, I would go to work. Um, thinking that I was fine when I was fine for I want to say a week I felt like great because um, they gave me medicine I don't I don't remember I've been taking a lot of medicine so um Yeah, it's, it's been a long process. So, I'm, I'm telling you, whoever's watching this, take care of your body. Because I did. And now, I'm paying the consequences of thinking that oh it's gonna go away you know you get a bruise you hit yourself a bruise oh it's gone when in reality it was something more more than that so I just wanted to make this video again just to say thank you to everybody. Uh, thank you who's been watching my videos. Thank you who has been very supportive. Um, a simple text. Because uh, I'm a type of person that See, this is the problem too with this virus. I'm very caring, very huggable. I like to show my affection. And I can't do that right now. I'm stuck in a position where it's, everything's six feet apart. You know, mask, everything. So that, at the same time, it's, it's hard. But I'm, I, I'm learning. Um, and hopefully, like I said, now that we have this vaccine, it will work. And everything could be back to normal again. And hopefully my body can be back to normal as well. Um, so I just want to say thank you. Uh, please subscribe, leave a comment. Um, if you're going through something like this, please let me know. So I know I'm not alone. Of course I'm not alone, but It would be nice to chat with someone that is going through the same process that I am. So, thank you very much and I'll see you guys later.